Susanna, dude. And he didn't get it at least. But he is so annoying. So annoying. I tried to be cool and clear the wave and hope I wasn't at level two. Nah, man. Nah, you did excuse. You're so done. Yeah, no, it was a bunch of fun compete. There was definitely a lot of laughing. As as is tradition, as is tradition, the very first roll of the game, my father wanted to make a uh, uh, perception check, and he rolled a one. As is the way God intended. As is the way God intended. My father, throughout the night, I would say he probably had, I don't know, by the time it was done, maybe he had like 12-ish dice rolls. Let's say like 12 dice rolls, right? Between his combat and checks and stuff. Maybe he maybe rolled like 12 to 15 dice. I would say he probably rolled a 1 25% of the time. I think out of 15 rolls, maybe about four of them were ones. About another 25% of them were below five. I think his highest, uh, I think his highest roll all night was like a, like a, like a 16 or something before, before, you know, any, any modifiers. So. Definitely, uh, definitely on par for him. My sister, on the other hand, I think she rolled two nat 20s yesterday. I think she had two nat 20s. Which was pretty awesome. And they came at pretty opportune times as well. It was pretty... They were both on uh, damage rolls. They were both on uh, attack rolls, so... Big, big, fat crits, dude. Big, fat, flipping crits. Which was nice. All right. Big fat crits. Big fat crits. Slain an enemy. Oh god. What's up, Susie Q? How you doing? And he's gone. And he's gone. Morning, Jack. How are you doing, friend? Morning. You're so lost in this conversation right now. It's okay, friend. I was teaching everybody D&D &D rules and stuff. It was a lot of fun. Everybody just like... I printed out class packets for everybody so they don't have to like memorize stuff. Everybody just has like a class packet so they can like always just like check back and look at their their packets or like there's like racial packets. So if anybody just wants to be like, ah, oh, I forget what this does, they just like have a little packet they could look at, you know. Printed out some uh, like actions you can do in combat and stuff. And the initiative tracker was by far the best thing I bought. It was like 60 bucks on Amazon, but. It was by far the best thing I bought. It made combat super easy and fluid. Like, I never had to worry about anything in combat because, like, 
everybody knew the order all the time because it was just up on the board in front of them and everybody like knew what was coming and i had all the stats right in front of me so i could just i didn't have to like ask them every turn like hey does this hit you i just i knew if it hit or not because i've got their armor class right in front of me and i've got everything right in front of me and it was just so easy and natural i don't know what i would have done without it actually it would have been a disaster Oh, God. Speaking of disasters, getting ganked by a Susana, dude. Can you buy Smite teammates on Amazon? Yeah, dude. I tried before, but in the package, it was just a jerby. And I, so I sent that right back, dude. Right back. D&D, Game of Preparedness, yeah. <laughs> was was I prepared for the entire campaign? Yes, I'm prepared for, like, the entire thing right now, but... <laughs> I think we probably got through, like, I don't even know, maybe 10% of it or something. Something like that. Just, a, like, this little starter, like, dealio. It was fun, though. Twas a lot of fun. Oppa! Nah, he's gone. Peace out, Susanna. Did they like it? Yeah, they were having a bunch of fun. They were having a bunch of fun. I got everybody to... Everybody's doing character voices and stuff. So, like, you know. If you want to make a decision out of character, that's fine. But then your characters have to, you know, discuss it in-game and make that choice. So, it's been fun. It's been fun. It's been a lot of fun. Should I be rotating to this blue buff? Probably not. Okay, it's not even up. Can I gank left lane, dude? I think I can. Yeah, buddy. Let's go. Quick cash and how old is Cat? Dude, I have no idea. I got no idea, dude. Thank you, Crow, for the three months, friend. An enemy has been slain. Thank you, thank you very much. <laughs> they they tried they, the, the the first the first boss was was basically a, a bugbear which is which is a pretty pretty hard pretty hard to fight a level one I'm not gonna lie in D and D it was a bugbear two goblins and a wolf um, which is which, which was, it was it was a hard it was a hard fight for this group of five level ones let me tell you um, because basically. The bugbear just kind of walked up to my brother, the paladin, and literally just like smacked him in the dome. And he was like immediately on the floor. Like almost instantly domed by this bugbear. Just got wrecked. Because if the bugbear hits you, I mean, he hits like for something crazy it's like 2d8 or something it's like if he hits you once he actually hits you twice and so it was a 2d8 at a level one which is like i mean you're you're roasty toasty dude please die ask and you shall receive said the lord uh-oh oh i'm in trouble maybe not actually oh my god that damage Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh my- <gasps> I guess I'm the best. 
I guess I'm just the best player to ever play Smite, and if you don't use your Twitch Prime to me, then what are you doing? Like, I don't even know. What are you doing with your life? Get it together. Content. Holy. Wow. Just wow. <laughs> My goodness. My good to the nest, dude. Sorry, bud. But yeah, no, it was it was a lot of fun. So the next the next thing is now just trying to figure out when we can get everybody, you know, back together again. That's gonna be the hard part. It took us about a month to find a date for us to work for everybody when we wanted to get this first session in, so I'm sure it'll be about a month again before we can play. So I'm sure. Something like that. I got the back out of the explosive force of a super volcano. <laughs> Your team has destroyed a right. Was a lot of flipping fun, though, man. Was a lot of flipping fun. An enemy has been slain. <laughs> nice swarm. That's the best tradition literally ever. This place is unprepared for what's next. Dude, just slap them. Just slap them with the hub. I, w I would never, man. You can't prove it. You can't prove it. Can't prove it. I got you, Apollo. I got you. I got you, baby. You're welcome. Kill secured, ladies and gentlemen. Kill secured. Freedom! Holy shit! You're on fire! Another Patriot has oh, it! Pew. Too bad my support's fading. Ah, we're fine. We're at a good spot. We got a 6k lead, dude. That's a massive lead. That's a massive lead. Massive. No, I have a 6k lead. Oh, okay. Is that different? But but what I meant, dude, is I am the team. Bum bum bum. Yeah, that's Cuckoo Beads out. Cuckoo Beads, Cuckoo Beads. Yeah, I'm coming over. Do, 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 do,
Uh, I'm just gonna back it up. I can get a full route to Hootie, so. Okay. I will soon Might as well. Might as well. Might as well. Yeah, I haven't seen a Hebo in ages. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, man. That's the fun part about casuals. I like, get to play guys, and I'm like, dude, I haven't played blank in forever, you know? Like, that's. I don't know. It's just fun like that. I get to play guys like Hebo that I totally, like, forgot existed. And then I get to go, oh, yeah, Hebo's, like, amazing. Hebo's amazing. Bye, Amy. Okay. An enemy has been slain. I actually die from this. That was a good idea, though. Time to go. 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 Go. Na 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 Ho 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 Woo! Magic! Where'd he go? <laughs> I'll make AMA disappear. Jeez Louise, dude. <laughs> Kibo, in fact, does damage. In fact, in case you forgot whether or not Hebo has got some decent damage in his kit, I just want you to remember that he does. Okay. So just Go ahead and keep that in mind the next time you're picking you're picking your characters, all right? Hebo, Hebo exists. Hebo exists. Holy cow. Holy cow. I literally haven't played Hebo in so long. Like I genuinely just forgot he was like in the game. Like I just didn't even look at him. So funny. Yeah, he both still got three okay. ultis. That's a good Aegis. Not gonna save your life, but it was a good Aegis. The idea was there, solidly. Uh oh. I'm dead, dude. That's gonna kill me. Oh, man. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, we alive, dude. Wow. We alive. Holy cow, we're gonna end the game. Oh my god, my boys literally just ended the game. Okay. Oh wait, no, they dove the fountain. Oh no, wait, they, are, they did end the game. 16 and 0. 35 to 16 in 19 minutes. Now that's a freaking smite game, dude. Woo!
All right. Heck yeah, dude. Heck yeah. All it took to get a win, dude, was 20,000 damage on Hebo.